I'm Anil Kumar and here are a few good questions from a test paper on polynomial functions. We are basically discussing remainder theorem and factor theorem. You can always pause the video, copy the question and try them as practice questions. In this video, we'll discuss question number 9. The question number 9 here is, the volume of cylindrical can is 4 pi x cubed plus 28 pi x square plus 65 pi x plus 50 pi centimeter cube. The can is x plus 2 centimeter high. What is the radius? Recall volume cylinder, the formula is pi r square h. Now let us see how to solve this question. So we are given the volume of the cylinder which we can write as 4 pi x cube plus 28 x square plus 65 pi x plus 50 pi units of centimeter cube. Now as the formula for our cylinder is uh, you know uh, pi r square h right so we can write the formula as pi r square h right that's the formula. We are also given height as x plus 2. Now we need to find radius. So height is given to us. We need to find radius. Now as you can see, we can actually simplify. Cancel pi. I forgot to write pi here. Okay. So pi is a common factor. So let me rewrite this equation. So I'll factor pi. So we get 4x cubed plus 28x squared plus 65x plus 50 and this is equals to pi r square and h is given to us as x plus 2 right so we can write here x plus 2 since we know that h equals to x plus 2 correct we need to find what r is for the time being we can simplify by cancelling pi and clearly r square can be written as 4x cube plus 28x square plus 65x plus 50 divided by x plus 2 which is the height right so when we divide we get square of radius now let us do long division and find this square of radius so let's do it here so we have four x cube plus twenty-eight x square plus sixty-five x plus fifty divided by x plus two. So we need to multiply by four x square, so that comes here, four x square. Then you get four x cube plus four times two is eight, so eight x square. So when you take away you get twenty x square plus bring down 65x right now you need to multiply by 20x so you get plus 20x that gives you 20x square plus 40x yeah when you take away you get 25 bring down 50 right so that is 25x i'm sorry now multiply by 25 then you get 25x i mean plus 50 right and the remainder is 0 so we can write this as r square when you divide this by that r square is indeed equals to the quotient which is 4x square plus 20x plus 25 now that is a perfect square 2x whole square 5 square 2 times 2x times 5 so I could write this as 2x plus 5 whole square so we have r square equals to 2x plus 5 whole square therefore r is 2x plus 5 correct okay? and now we can write down our answer that the radius r equals to 2x plus 5 the units are centimeters so that is how you can solve such a question i hope that helps thank you 
and all the best.